Hi, uh, welcome to Kovacs Technical Support. Uh, today uh, we have uh, another T9 here and uh, the customer complaint is that uh, uh, white light remain on. So uh, actually here I just uh, want to some uh, want to give some explanation that why always this white light is on. So once we power on the debug, I think this one is a new user. I uh, According to the data purchase, this one is a new user uh, just a few months before this customer buy and Customer actually not aware about the functions uh, and how it works. That is a reason customer sent here for, I think maybe just only for service he sent here. There's nothing wrong with the d -board actually. So once we power on the d -board, so this light start blinking. The main power button light start blinking. And after a few seconds, this light stop blinking and became solid white light. There's a solid white light here. And once we press this button, so d -board start moving like that. This is the function actually. Until this light is blinking, whether you press this button, d -board will not move because d -board is not yet ready to use. Once this, you see here, the solid white light, it's not blinking at all. No, d -board is ready to use. Okay. And the other thing is uh, we have here air freshener and the Osmo Pro tank also for the same customer, same uh, customer that you sent here. So once we attach in T9 model air freshener, Air freshener has been installed. We will receive this message, but the light remain white. The light color will not change. Just only we will hear the message from the D board that the air freshener has been installed. From there we can see, okay, the D board, uh, the air freshener is installed already, and now it's ready to use because this one is a solid white light. It's ready to use. So once we attach the mopping uh, function, this one, the Osmo Pro tank, then. Light color will be changed from white to blue and this one will be the blue solid light. It's not the blinking blue light. If when we press this one, so d -board will start functioning. Start functioning like that. And this one also actually should be vibrating, but this one is not vibrating. No, it means that there is something wrong with the maybe Osmo Pro tag or maybe there is something wrong with the connection. As you can see here, it light became blue. Uh, sorry, the white again. But the Osmo Pro tank is already installed but still it's showing here the white light it means that there is something wrong maybe with the connector here this connector maybe is loosened is not attached properly or maybe there's something wrong with the Osmo Pro tank so we replace this one or we replace this one then only we can confirm that which part was faulty and then problem will be solved but the function wise once we attach this uh, Osmo Pro tank there should be a solid blue light here and once we press this button, it start moving and the Volvo Pro tank should be start vibrating and the light here should be blue. It's not white. If it became while functioning, while it became blue, uh, white, then it means that uh, there is something wrong with the connector. So we need to check that one. So hopefully you like this video. So the, if the light became uh, white, uh, so it's because we are using the d -board and it's ready to use. So it's uh, nothing wrong. Maybe the, actually the customer mentioned here that the, he's using the Osmo Pro tank and the light became white. There should be blue light. If its light became white, it means that there is something wrong with the connector or maybe there is something wrong with the Osmo Pro tank itself. So we will check which part is faulty, whether this one or this one. But there is only one reason. Maybe the most likely is the connector only. So connector we will replace and after that will be okay, no problem. Then once we attach this one, the light became blue like that. And then once we press this one, still became blue. So this is, a, I mean, the function in T9. Uh, maybe there is uh, the connector issue, this one. And confirm, this one I tested already, just only the connector issue, this one, the connector here. And the Osmo Pro tank is okay, nothing wrong. So what is the connector? What happened to the connector? I show you here in this video. Okay, you can bring over here, you can run nearby. Just only the one wire, this one broken from here that's all so if you couldn't find the part you can just take out from here and this one can solder back and then still can use but i replaced already the new one because new one we have the part here and now i show you the it's showing here the white light as you can see here because osmo pro tank not yet installed so now i will install the osmo pro tank and you will hear the uh, message also the voice message the osmo pro tank, uh, pro tank has been installed and you will see the light color also will change Osmo Pro install and the light color change already. 
So no, before that when I press here, so when I press this one, so after a few seconds the light became white again. So that is the customer was complaining actually. The light, uh, white light became remain uh, white. So because it shouldn't be white if we are using the Osmo Pro tank, it should be blue here. So the light color change, that's why the customer sent here for a repair actually. I tested already. Before that, I thought maybe just the customer actually didn't know that about the function. That's why the customer sent here. But when I run here <laughs> physically, then I understand that, okay, just only the connector issue. So I replace the connector after that. Now I show you here. Okay, the light remained blue. And this one off little. If we are using the Osmo Pro tank, the light must be here blue. If while using Osmo Pro tank the light became white here, means that uh, you're something wrong with the connector. As I show you here, that uh, this wire connection just only broken from here. That is why the Osmo Pro tank was not uh, functioning. But when we attached, so it was giving message that Osmo Pro tank installed because the one wire is still there attached. That's why it's, it can catch the signal. But it gives error and it uh, won't function because the one of the wire was broken from there. So we replace already. So this is how we, I mean, uh, fix this issue. The white light and the blue light, what is the difference and when they will show you the white light or the blue light and when the color will change everything I explained in this video. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you very much. Thanks.